Well, I got involved in an unlikely chari charity called the Compton Junior Posse. And most of you probably know Compton as sort of gang, you know, gang members. There was a movie called Straight Out of Compton or, or Straight Out of Compton. Right. <laughs> no, I don't know anything about that. <laughs> <laughs> But actually, uh, Compton was originally um, zoned for agriculture mm -hmm. many, many years yes, ago, the early 1900s. So um, there, it's still zoned for agriculture, and there's a little equestrian center there. Mm -hmm. And I saw these wonderful kids uh, who are taking horseback riding lessons. It's really a way to learn how to be a leader, right. learn responsibility, and prepare them to go out into the world. Mm -hmm. And what really got me, what got me involved, is one of the kids who had graduated from high school, had been in the program, and went to University of Wisconsin, the, the summer before he went in, he was shot at a party. Mm. Wow. And he was, he was okay, and he went on to school. And I thought to myself, how many other freshmen at the University of Wisconsin were shot right before they mm. went to school? Like, these kids are going into the world with a very different right. uh, experience of life. So I've just have been finding myself driving to Compton, going, I'm, okay, we're going to Compton. Oh, brother, we're going to Compton. <laughs> And actually, this past weekend and the, uh, the upcoming weekend, uh, I joined a um, hundred uh, volunteers from the Mormon mm -hmm. Church, and have been cleaning up uh, the stables and painting and getting furniture and computers in for the kids for after-school programs. So um, I'm really excited to do something locally in mm -hmm. LA. But it, you know, it's a, it has a bigger impact. These kids are all going out into the world, and um, they, yes. they need to have some of the advantages that my kids right across the freeway right. have. Right. Absolutely. And there's only Absolutely. a freeway dividing us, and it shouldn't be that way. And that's why.